This is Aaron with anetcomputers.com with another video for you today. This video deals with how to fix your Apple iPhone 10 facial identification not working. Now, once upon a time, I wrote a blog post dealing detailing how at that time that the Apple iPhone 10 facial recognition had been circumvented and I documented it. Basically a company, a research company, created a mask, a face, a fake mask, and was able to trick the Apple iPhone 10 facial recognition system. However, this video deals with how to fix if your facial recognition identification is not working on your Apple iPhone 10. This comes directly from Apple support.apple.com uniform resource located on screen highlighted just type that into the address bar of your web browser there are eight potential tips here if your face identification is not working on your iPhone these are the steps the first possible way is to check for updates so on your Apple iPhone, you can check for any Apple iPhone operating system updates and install any updates that could potentially fix your issue with face identification not working. You could also check the face identification settings. It's also known as facial recognition. You know what I'm saying? You can go to settings in your Apple iPhone. Then you would select face identification and passcode there's a screen there's an image of it here right here and you want to make sure that face identification is set up so if it's not set up it obviously will not work and that the other features are turned on that you're trying to use you may have difficulties with facial recognition identification with just the iTunes or Apple Store using your wallet and Apple Pay or perhaps you know automatically filling in passwords so make sure that any of these are checked or whichever ones that you're trying to use okay so that's a potential way to fix your Apple iPhone 10 facial identification not working now the Apple iPhone 10 came with a true depth camera so you want to make sure that nothing is covering the true depth camera and actually it was in this photograph at the beginning you know what I'm saying it could even be a smudge yeah you might want to clean it up you could clean up the camera you know what I mean anything on the case or even a screen protector definitely a a case might might be actually covering up the true death camera also if you are using well this is Apple iPad so that doesn't quantify okay let's move along so that's the third possible way the fourth possible way to fix the Apple iPhone 10 facial identification not working is make sure that your face is not being blocked so that means your entire face man so you got to make sure that your eyes nose and mouth are fully visible to the true depth camera all right so if anything is covering any parts of your mouth and nose then facial identification will not work all right also a face mask now there there is a way to make it work. It says if you are wearing a face mask and then you have already set up the face identification with a mask option, make sure that your eyes are not blocked. And they also recommend that you may, have, I didn't, but, they, but Apple did, you might need to hold your Apple iPhone higher if you're wearing a face mask. Yes, if your face mask is too high or too close to your eyes, 
then the Apple iPhone 10 facial identification recognition may not work. It may not unlock. Your eyes are important. When I study the facial recognition identification in the Apple iPhone 10, your eyes are extremely important. You know what I'm saying? It may work with sunglasses. What else? Although they claim that if you wear a face mask and also sunglasses, it will not work. It's not designed for that. You know what I mean? Now it says if now if you're not wearing a mask and if you are wearing sunglasses that are designed to block certain sunlight, then actually your sunglasses might be blocking the infrared light that the true death camera uses. So then you would want to remove your sunglasses using some basic logic <laughs> and then try to use the facial identification feature in Apple iPhone 10. The fifth possible fix is make sure that you are actually facing the true depth camera. They claim that facial identification does work in both portrait, which is vertical, and landscape, which is horizontal orientation. But this, this claims 13 and 14. Oh, my bad. I was wrong. Actually, the iPhone 10 face identification only works on the iPhone when it's in portrait, which means vertical orientation. And then, but you also want to face the actual true depth camera. Okay, let's see. Number six, you can restart your Apple iPhone 10. And then try the face identification. Maybe the service, the process is frozen up or something. And then, but they say that you need to enter your passcode. All right. So just try restarting your Apple iPhone 10. See if that fixes your issue. Let's say, for example, the facial identification process was frozen up or just not working correctly. By restarting it, it would stop that process. And then when you, you know, log back into your Apple iPhone and then start the facial recognition, you know what I mean? Then it'll start that process again. Okay. Now, there is a way to add a alternative appearance of yours. Yeah, the facial identification is supposed to learn as you change. Like, yeah, it's kind of bizarre, but whatever. If you start, you know, letting your beard, your, you don't shave and you're male and you're, you know, you've got a beard now or a mustache, it's supposed to recognize, you're supposed to learn that. Now, if you are like, I don't know, a emissary or some kind of agent and you have a completely different look <laughs> I don't know why you would or if you're a male and your wife is trying to serve you divorce papers and you don't want her to know what you look like and you change your your appearance and but you still need to access your Apple iPhone 10 because you may need to contact your lawyer at any minute just in case it, it doesn't work <laughs> you know those kind of quagmires then what you can do is set up an alternate appearance and then so that the facial identification will recognize you. Otherwise, you're, you could be screwed. You know what I mean? The eighth possible fix for your Apple iPhone 10 facial identification not working is to go ahead and reset your facial identification settings. So you would browse the settings and then you would tap face ID and passcode and then you would select reset face identification. Then finally, you would choose set up face ID to set it up again. So you can re you can set it up again. Maybe I don't know. It could be buggy. You know, I, Apple products are not perfect. No, no product that I've ever researched is actually perfect when it comes to computers and computing devices. Maybe it became corrupt. Just, just who knows. So that's why resetting it might actually fix the issue. Finally, number nine, nine possible way to fix your Apple iPhone 10 face facial recognition identification not working is you would then contact Apple support. This is kind of a strange sentence. <laughs> 
if you still cannot enroll your face. Well, I don't know in context what they mean by that. Enroll? You know, like take a your, uh, a bowling roll, like when you roll dough on your face or, or you're registering your face for some database? I don't know. I don't know. So when in doubt, you could contact Apple support. You know what I'm saying? If you cannot get it to work, you know. And I, I don't even want to go there, but I mean, maybe you would have to, you would want to back up your data and then perform a factor reset, but that may or may not be overkill. All right. So that is my video pertaining to how to fix your Apple iPhone 10 face identification not working, also known as facial recognition. You can always browse to anetcomputers.com to fix your most common computer problems. Also, you can find out where I'm located on the internet, the plethora of platforms that I'm accessible. Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, youtube.com slash anetcomputers. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel. Trollo.live, twitch.tv, and even Rumble. How dare I upload my videos or make my vi actually my videos are synchronized from YouTube. Yeah, I'm I'm transparent. Yeah, I just gave you what I just told. Yeah, I'm transparent. I just told you that my videos on Rumble are actually synchronized from my YouTube channel and they allow it. I don't actually have to upload them. You know what I'm saying? What you think that we censor YouTube is the only video platform on the planet? <laughs> It is the best paid, but whatever. Well, that you could argue that. I don't, you know, whatever. Adios.